When you drive through any town and see plantings throughout the business district, chances are that was done by the local garden club as part of their effort to beautify the town. Recently, the Kingston Garden Club held their annual plant sale and PCN met up with some of the members to find out what makes them tick. The annual plant sale helps to provide money for the plants that we have in the downtown area of Kingston. It also gives plants for the um, Pottle Street along the railroad tracks. We also have 18 or so uh, gardens that we take care of that other people volunteer to take care of, but we provide the plants. The Saturday before Mother's Day is the time that we traditionally hold our annual plant sale. And we pick that time because people are ready to, you know, pot up some plants and, and bring a gift to mom. We even have some little uh, small gift items uh, that are really appropriate for Mother's Day. But it's, it's t the time for color. That's when people start thinking about it. Here at our plant sale, we divide up perennials from our gardens and, and we'll bring them in and um, sell those. But then we add in some annuals and that's what gives us the color. We pick up, uh, you know, some of the wonderful coleus and uh, begonias and uh, we have some uh, geraniums and uh, all kinds of wonderful color inside uh, that can make up beautiful containers or can be used for borders and that kind of thing and this is the time of year. We start sending memos out early in the year just reminding people actually we started last September working on this program and um, it's one of our biggest money makers for, the, for our year other than a craft fair that we have at Christmas time. We also provide $750 a year to a student at Silver Lake that is going into horticultural activities. And um, they, they apply and we vote on whoever has the best qualifications. We really appreciate the town, the support that they give us. Um, and it's not, well, it's a town, it's their relatives, it's friends that come from Duxbury, from Pembroke, all, even the, the neighboring towns. They've supported us anytime we have any type of a fundraiser. They've been wonderful. The town people, when we're working in the little gardens, they, uh, they toot the horn, they put the window down, toot the horn and wave, and, and it really makes you feel good when you're volunteering all this time and doing this um, for the town that people do appreciate it.